supposed to be un like unenjoyable. That's like the, the the purpose of being scared is that you don't like fucking want to. Yeah, I, I I get that, but the whole point is that humans and other intelligent animals have been able to find ways of manipulating their biology in order to create experiences and actually turn them into enjoyable ones. Like alcohol, like plants decay and turn into a vinegarish, sour taste and you actually can create hallucinogenic or mood altering um, symptoms and so you do it as a form of recreation. Like, why would you, why would you eat rotten food as a form of recreation and like... That's a good point, what but, about, but it's different. What about sex? Like, that's only supposed to be for procreative purposes, but by manipulating the way our bodies work, it can be a source of enjoyment. Yeah, like, yeah but that's not the same. I think it is the same. No, it's it's that, like, our bodies are designed in a certain way to produce certain emotions, and we can actually take advantage of them to create recreational activities. Yeah, why would being scared be enjoyable at all? Well... It's supposed to be a negative emotion to stop you from doing dangerous things. I know, yeah. So, like, it doesn't even make sense. Like, but... Well... Like, that would, that to me would say there's, like, something wrong with me because it's not working the way it's supposed <laughs> to work. Why would anyone, um, tell stories? Like, why would there be movies and novels based on stories that never happened? which manipulate our emotional emotions of sympathy it's so that we start... It's though. <laughs> Is it? Yeah. Because that's like a fantasy thing. Yeah. So, our, our, our tool of empathy should only be used for caring about our fellow human beings, but we can manipulate this to care about non-existent people so that we can explore the emotion of sympathy and feel this person's story. Point. What do you think? It's a valid point you raised there, <laughs> kind sir. But, um, but. yeah, it, like adrenaline is an exciting chemical, it really, you know, affects the way you feel and think. And it can be exciting if you, like, do it in doses that you can control. It's different when you don't have control over it.